Hello everyone, this is Static and I am Fanatic to bring you guys another Minecraft video. Today I'm here showing you another redstone tutorial on a combination lock door. So for my demonstration today, you can see that the door is locked and we can't get in. It's an iron door, we can't open it and uh, we have to input the password. We can start flicking some random levers, nothing is going to happen, we can turn them on all on <clears throat> nothing will happen again until we get the right password which i set to be this one this one and this one at which this light will turn on saying it was correct and we can walk straight through okay so for today's tutorial i have laid out the materials that you're going to need you're going to need eight green wool and one iron door you're going to need six redstone lamps and five levers you are going to need, <clears throat> we're going to skip redstone for a second, we're, we, uh, you're going to need six redstone repeaters and so for redstone torches you need a redstone torch for every single one. So if you want them all on that would be five, one, two, three, four, five. You need five redstone torches. If you want to do what I did, which my combination lock was like this, you're only going to need three. And <clears throat> kind of the same thing for redstone. Um, so I just grabbed a stack of 64 because that'll definitely be enough redstone and also to build this thing you can have any blocks you want. I chose quartz pillars and smooth quartz. Quartz pillars being here and smooth quartz just being here. Okay. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you are going to want to place wool behind all of your lights with the redstone on top of all of that. Okay, just like that. And this is where you can decide what you want your pattern to be. I'm going to stick with my same pattern just like this, but yours could be anything. I'll show you how to do it. So on all of the ones that are lit up, the ones that you chose, you're going to place a redstone torch behind. Just like this, okay? And the other ones, just redstone on the ground, just like this. So again, a uh, torch on the ones that are lit up and just regular redstone dust on the ones that aren't. From there, you can put a repeater coming out of all of these just like this. So the redstone dust will um, be attached and the uh, redstone torch will also be attached just like this. Okay, then we can run our wire just like this and we can set up this lamp display. So. What we are going to want is we are going to want a repeater here. We're going to want a repeater here. And just for the time being, I'm going to make a little um, box just like this. So it's kind of like a hallway, right? And you're going to want uh, your green wool here, a redstone dust there, and then we can place a, um, a redstone torch just like that. So I should like this look like this and then all you have to do is run your redstone wire into it like this and guess what guys that is the entire thing as all it took so now you can see that this door we can walk through because we got the correct password if we unflick it and don't get the correct password this light will shut off and the door will close and um, yeah we can make it so we have our own uh, key card password just like that I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please like and consider subscribing. It does help a, out a lot. And um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. You guys can hopefully use this on all your survival worlds and SMPs with your friends where they can't get into your secret bases. So yeah, I can't wait. <clears throat> and I will see you guys next time. Bye.